So once again, we got some terrible news to report, and this time, Insomniac is on the forefront of this one. Following sweeping layoffs in the gaming industry, Sony and lots of beloved studios under the brand, it's filling it, and a few games are already confirmed cancelled. Let's talk about it. No, God, please, no. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Saga, bringing you awesome, fast information regarding all things PlayStation gaming. If you enjoy content that respects your time, hit the like button to get this video out to other gaming fans. But if you didn't, drop a dislike so I know exactly where to improve. So yeah, once again, layoffs are hitting the gaming world, and this time Sony's in the crosshairs. Sadly, being a PlayStation-focused channel, this means a lot of games, probably a good portion of you are playing, are being affected by this. First off, Sony has laid off a staggering 900 employees, which will be affecting studios like Naughty Dog, creators of Last of Us and Watch Dogs, Insomniac Games with Spider-Man and the upcoming Wolverine game, and sadly Fire Sprite, a London-based studio that was working on, get this, the Twisted Metal Live Service game. Now personally, I grew up in the late 90s, early 2000s, so to see another Twisted Metal game getting cancelled is a bit disheartening. Now sadly, the bad news doesn't stop there, and as I mentioned earlier, Insomniac has taken a hit in the workforce. As we know from insider information, some people working on the now leak Wolverine game was laid off. Once again, the bad news doesn't end there as there was another game in the works, an upcoming multiplayer based Spider-Man game now cancelled once again. Now recently, I made a video going over the cancellation of the Mandalorian game. Check that out in the description if you haven't seen it yet. But as I said in that video, gaming companies are starting to sadly move away from certain IPs and stick into things that work and IPs they already own. Now on one hand, that sounds pretty damn good, especially considering Insomniac slash Sony does have a extremely strong IP with Spider-Man. But on the other hand, it is frustrating to see that we very likely will be seeing less and less creative games coming out of the gaming world. With all that in mind, a few questions I don't see a lot of people asking or even mentioning. First off, what is going to happen with the upcoming Wolverine game? Considering the game has been pretty much leaked and while I do think the game looks phenomenal in its pre-release state, I'm sure to some degree the hype was a bit killed. On top of this, we haven't really heard any news on the in-development TMNT game that's being developed by Black Forest that did recently lay off over half his workforce, which begs the question how long until that one hit the chopping block. Either way, things are continuing to look pretty grim for the gaming world and hopefully layoffs slow down. The video on screen now goes over the possibility of yet another highly anticipated game, Grand Theft Auto 6, facing some huge drama that could delay the release. Check it out.